Uh, you've always said you, you, you wouldn't fancy a trip to space, would no. you? No, okay. thanks. How do, how do you feel about a potential holiday here? Uh, this, they, they say you might be ready in 2027, 20, um, which is uh, somewhere you can go... So, essentially, these are hotel rooms around the edge here. Your uh, shuttle would arrive here in the middle, and that's where you get dropped off. And you'd be able to do... It does have a touch of the Moonrakers about it, doesn't it? Uh, also, um, 2001 A Space Odyssey looks a bit like the one that Stanley Kubrick... I mean, you'd have a lovely view, wouldn't you? You would have a lovely view. Um, there, apparently, there'd be a gym in the outside, there'd be a restaurant, you'd be able to go Where's on... Where's the sea, though? Well, there Where's is no... the beach? You're in space, Louise. <laughs> uh, you can go on a spacewalk. You'd be able to go on a spacewalk around it. And this is the good news. If you are slightly concerned... It's going to cost a lot of money, isn't well, it? Well, th th that's the one thing they haven't released. There's been no uh, uh, sort of even discussion about how much it would cost to get there and what a room might cost. But if it all went horribly wrong, Louise, fear not. There would be 44 escape pods known as emergency return vehicles, and they'd be automatically programmed to take you back to Earth. Thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> um, I think I'll be in.